Hello Youtubers, I'm Parways and this is our 17th video in Learn Django 2.1. In the previous video we have learned about uh, condition statements in Django template. Uh, in this video I want to show you how you can render uh, data from your MySQL database into your templates. So uh, in the previous videos uh, we have uh, rendered, uh, let me open, these data in our template but in this video I want to show you how you can uh, access to your data uh, from your MySQL database into your uh, Django templates so uh, in the previous videos I have uh, created uh, two models first one is uh, sport news and the second one is uh, the first one is news and the second one is sport news and if you check your model and let me open my models.py so this is uh, now also let me open my WAMP server uh, for example news uh, let me open this and you can see I have uh, some data in here uh, the author uh, this is news title and this is news description uh, now uh, for this First, I'm going to open my views.py because I want to create a new view and let me bring it in here. Just uh, copy this. And let me copy this and paste it in here. So this is uh, this should be news details and also I want to make a HTML file for this. it should be news underscore details dot html and also give the context so after creating your view function let me open my templates and in here I need a file a news underscore details details dot html okay now the first thing you need uh, let me just copy these files and add this my in here so this is our news details page okay now if I okay before this I need to add my URL in urls.py uh, let me open this And here, uh, just copy this. Okay, now change this to details, and uh, this should be news details dot. on use details and the name for the name you can give it for example just details okay now we have created this and let me uh, open this uh, details You can see this is our news details and also I want to add a navbar uh, to here. Just open your navbar.html and just copy this. Let me paste it in here and URL change this to details. details okay like this also change this to mm, details or it should be news details okay now save it and open your page
now you can see we have an avatar in here I go to the home I go to the contact I go to about and I go to the news details now in this page I want to uh, render my data from MySQL database for this I'm going to open my views function and in here okay in this section first you need to import your uh, model at the top you need to import this uh, from dot models import mm, what should I import let me open my models dot by uh, yeah this is okay import news okay now we have imported this and in here uh, we want to create object of our news so in news details let me create obj and news dot objects dot get for right now I just want up uh, one item so ID 0 okay use dot objects dot get and I want ID 1 so now in your context you can simply write object OBJ okay now after this open your uh, HTML file uh, yeah this is I think yeah news details dot HTML now in here we are going to access to our data you can simply uh, let me just first uh, make um, let me open this I have an author I have title and I have description so it should be the author should be an h1 tag object dot author okay and after this I have uh, uh, title and description I don't want the ID in h2 I want the title object dot title and in P paragraph I want to object dot description object dot description like this okay now I'm going to save this and hopefully um, let me go to the home this is our home contact about and news details yeah you can see this is our title uh, it was part ways and if you check the database yeah this is and this is news title news title and this is news description uh, thank you guys. If you have any questions, please let me know. And for the further videos, please subscribe to my channel.